Hi, this is Next Simulator. This is a tutorial on how to set up your transmitter to your simulator for use. You will need a compatible transmitter cable, which there is a list on the Next website. I'll include a link in the description below. Once you've got that, plug that into your computer and plug it into your radio. That or if you are using a joypad, then just plug the joypad straight into the USB. Then what you'll need to do is you'll need to load the simulator up and press the Alt key to get your menu up. And the first thing you'll need to do is you'll need to go on to the simulator tab. And what you'll need to look at is the very top one, which is your in like you can set up four different types of inputs. Usually all you'll need is just one. So what you'll need to do is you'll need to make sure that your sticks are turned on, right? This is showing your sticks on the, the simulator okay if the throttles the wrong way around then you need to click the positive pitch normal or inverse then what you'll need to do is press calibrate input device select your stick mode so the stick mode is what flight mode you fly in whether that be mode 1 mode 2 mode 3 or mode 4 in this case it's mode 2 and then what you'll do is you'll click start calibration at the bottom it'll ask you what kind of device that you have it'll ask whether you have a joypad or a transmitter in this case it's a transmitter and what that'll do is it'll automatically set defaults for your dead zone and threshold your dead zone will be automatically set to 2 your threshold will be set to 15 and that is the minimum value for a channel to be recognized All right. and what we'll do next is if you look at the instructions here, it'll ask you to center all sticks and trims, which I have, and then click next. And if you look at the pictures of the sticks, it'll ask you where it wants you to put the sticks. So in this case, it's full collective to maximum pitch, and click next. It'll then ask you to move to full bottom, click next. Full right rudder, next. Full left rudder, next. Right aileron, left aileron, forward elevator, and backward elevator. Then if you leave the sticks in the middle and click finish, that will have set your transmitter up. If you just close the pages down, you'll find that you'll have full control. Just turn the engine on. So we have collective up and down, rudder, left and right, aileron, left and right and we have elevator as well okay so that is how you set up your transmitter to the next simulator thanks for watching bye